your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, outside right now, all is clear and quiet. It is a beautiful Monday evening across the region. Low humidities, warm temperatures, and yeah, we were well above average again earlier today as we topped out at 84 after a morning start of 58. Plenty of sunshine out there as well, translating to clear skies right now. Look at those numbers, still 71 to 75 across the downtown region. Humidity 41% of south breeze in here now, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Of course, the radar scope, a clean sweep, just some false echoes around the antenna. We'll hold on to those dry skies tonight and really into tomorrow morning as well. These were the highs across the Ohio Valley, summer-like actually, and well above average just about everywhere. Look at Chicago, 83. We were one better at 84, and St. Louis taking the cake, so to speak, up to 87 degrees. Here's the weather in motion now. Quiet around here, quiet across the two-state region. Severe thunderstorm watch in effect for sections of Chicago, the southern suburbs on into northwestern Indiana, being kicked off by that little low pressure system that's scooting its way easterly across the lower lakes. Now much of the energy will bypass us, and as a result, the bigger storms overnight tonight will stay off to the north of us. I think we'll stay dry and plenty mild, plenty comfortable as well, upper 50s and low 60s outside the city in Louisville itself, middle 60s by the time you wake up and get your day started. We'll see some passing clouds in the morning, but the way it's looking right now, dry skies. But as the front off to the north of us gets a little bit closer and the moisture starts to increase, the dew point temperatures turns a little bit stickier, if you will, midday through tomorrow afternoon. I think both those elements will con combine forces to uh, bring us scattered showers and storms later in the day. Absolute best chances will be north and also west during the afternoon and early evening hours. But I think everybody will get into chances tomorrow night and Wednesday. Look at your highs, though. Another summer-like day, low to middle 80s for Tuesday afternoon. This is the bigger system we're watching. This is really going to ramp up the rain chances as a piece of energy breaks away from this thing and comes at us tomorrow night and Wednesday, as I mentioned. Now, during tomorrow evening, this is going to cause actually a big severe weather outbreak for the central plains as some of that energy reaches in our direction our rain chances will also go up 60 percent tomorrow night and we're looking at 70 percent chances wednesday and wednesday night so here's our forecast waking up to 64 in the morning some passing clouds by midday those temperatures will climb to 76 and then tomorrow mid to late afternoon some widely scattered showers and storms a possibility those chances continue tomorrow night wednesday and wednesday night and then Rick Freddy, we get a window of dry weather in here Thursday, Friday into Saturday morning. And that bodes really, really well for some of those Derby Festival events going on. The Great Balloon Fest, for example. The track Saturday mm -hmm. could be a little wet Saturday afternoon.